Did your son see the film and uh, Suleiman and Qasim and what was their re reaction to the film? I'm glad you asked that because um, their reaction has definitely been the highlight for me of the whole experience. Really? Because they are not rom-com lovers. They don't like those kinds of films. They're quite, they're my biggest critics. And obviously they're, you know, half Pakistani Muslim kids. So they, you know, whether they liked it or not was very, very important to me. Um, I got them in to see it and they said, at the end of it, I could see they'd been like a little tearful. Oh. And I'd also heard them laughing and they said, I'm always so proud of you. And I think they knew how hard I'd worked at it. And I literally thought, oh, well, if no one else likes it, it this is the moment. To that be must proud be a of. very, very proud moment for you. Why did you decide to uh, cast Sajal Ali in that uh, very key role in your film? So what happened was I, um, we were looking for, we wanted someone who was a perfect match for Lily James, someone who was as beautiful, as good an actress, as vivacious and as nuanced as, as Lily James. And so <clears throat> I don't know if talent agencies exist in Pakistan, but I didn't know of one. So instead I rang up an old friend of my ex-husband, Yusuf Salahuddin, yeah. and I rang him up and I said, Yusuf, Yusuf I need Sally. your help. You know, because Yusuf Sali is kind of, I think, unofficial king of culture in Pakistan. Yeah. And I said to him, tell me, this is what I need. I need her to be this age. I need her to look like this, da, da, da. Is there anyone? And he said, Sajal. And so he sent me a video. He put me in touch with her manager. And then after that, she auditioned for the part. And everyone was just in agreement that she was perfect for it. So it's Yusuf who was the casting agent.